Hi. Today I'm doing something that I have been wanting to do ever since I started my YouTube channel. But for different reasons I have not been able to do it. But now I think I can. <laughs> Wait. And I have found a fun way to do it. But I just want to say that don't have too high expectations because this is the first time I'm doing this and it's kind of you, you see from the title but it's me talking about new makeup releases but I'm not going to talk about everything I'm going to talk about stuff that has probably already come out uh, I'm not going to do this every week or something like that I'm just going to do it when I feel like it and I'm going to do it the bingo style, just like um, Teresa is dead and Emily Han Han. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. I will link both of them down below. Uh, but uh, the the main idea is that I talk about makeup releases and I have a bingo. What are you calling it? In Swedish, we call it like bingo bricka. Uh, I don't think you call it bingo brick, but I'm going to show you. But I have uh, done a thing <laughs> um, with different things and I'm actually waiting on a thing to work here because, you know, I'm filming, still filming with my phone and I have saved all the images on my phone. And I can't use the phone, so I have tried to make make them come into my iPad. But, oh, that was dirty on the back. Let's fix that later. But yeah, we'll see. Uh, let's see. Let's do like that. I'm sorry, I'm back now. I hope I cut that out. Clip <laughs> it. But um, I don't think I will do the same every time. I will have the kind of same concept but right now uh, I don't know how I will pick the pictures because I know that Therese and Emily have uh, you know a random thing picking and so on but yeah never mind but the thing is that I'm going to try to get bingo or when I get bingo I will stop talking and they usually drink alcohol I'm going to drink Pepsi Max lime So I'm doing this kind of my own way and this is the thing I have done. I don't know if you can see because it's so shiny. You can pause and look. Let's see, like that. But the thing is, uh, here it says makeup brand going skincare. So it's like when I'm, I'm not going to explain this every time, but I'm doing this the first time. It's when a makeup brand decides to do skincare. Which, which it says um, and then it says influencer collab it's an influencer collab then there's a picture of a Morphe palette and it's if they release new big ass Morphe palettes then there's a picture of a unicorn and yes I have done this myself I, I'm that type of person and I have a machine that can are you calling it this laminate as well because that's what they call in Swedish but yeah uh, it's a unicorn and it's like if something has a unicorn theme and I can also count, you know, mermaids and so on. Then it says another lip gloss because I feel like everyone is releasing lip gloss. And this is inspired by the, uh, I don't know what this is called, but Emily and Teresa has one of these as well. And some of these are inspired by or just taken <laughs> from there and I have asked them if it's okay to me to do this video so you know and they said okay <laughs> but yeah but some I have put in myself but I think that everyone is releasing lip glosses so yeah that's what that is then we have Colourpop and then we have I want it only for the packaging <laughs> and Multichrome I'm sorry this is so awkward but then we have duos and then we have weird shape of a palette and that's the pizza palette. <laughs> then we have a revolution, revol revolution chocolate bar, that one. Then we have bundle deal no one want, wants, 
Should it say want? No one wants. Then it's a green palette because it feels like everyone is releasing a green palette. Then it says copycat and you all know what that means. Then it's a matte foundation. Then it's a picture of beauty blender, you know, if they release another color. Then we have half neutral, half color, if there is a palette. And the palette is actually life to drag, but yeah. Can you see? Then we have holiday release, two months early. So, you know, it's not, now it's Christmas, but so that's what the holiday mean in this now i'm so sorry if this is boring but um but you can use this you know for easter and summer and so on but it's when it comes too early don't say that then it's pressed glitter in a palette and then it's stick i'm sorry but it feels like everyone is doing stick foundation stick blush stick whatever so that's what that is. That is a rainbow. You all know what that means. Then we have Papa Blue. And then we have Kylie because she's like color pop. Then we have basic as fuck neutral palette. And then we have fruit. Fruit theme. So that's what we have playing. And I should have recorded this a while ago. But I did, couldn't find my whiteboard pens. So now I have it. Okay. I, I will try to do my best. This will be so hard to edit, but yeah. So I'm just going to take some and I will be better prepared next time, but I just want to do it now and, you know, get going. So should I move? That's weird, but I think I will have a picture up here. Oh, please make that work. And all of these pictures are, most of them at least are from Trendbull, but I will link down below where I have gotten the pictures and I hope that is okay. Yeah, let's start. <laughs> let's start with Kaleidos Cosmetics. It's so weird to talk about a thing when I can't see it on the screen, but I know you can do it, but I'm not used to this, I'm sorry. Kaleidos Cosmetics, uh, there are two new palettes, Futurism 5 and 6. Um, I have ordered those uh, and I've actually gotten the shipping notification. I'm so excited. I have the other three, but I've only used one. Yeah, but I love them. And I really love the color schemes, especially the neon one. And um, I'm going to count that as a rainbow palette. Bloop. This was a terrible pen. Let's take the black one. Please work. Yada. Oops. It worked. So that's how it works. Rainbow! And I love them. And I have seen both Paulina and... Um, Angelica and Annette use them and mm, they look so pretty and I want them very much. Uh, I'm sorry. You can can you please give me feedback if I'm going to talk about it some other way? But I'm more like doing this if I'm going to buy it and what I think, nothing else. Um, but I will notice if no one watches this. I'm so sorry. I will be better until the next one. Uh, then we have the Lime Crime, uh, the new fun size palette. Um, and of course I have not what it's called because I can't click on it. But yeah, you can see it. Uh, I so want this palette so much. But I'm not going to order it from uh, Sugar... Did I say Lime Crime before? I meant Sugar Pill. I hope I said sugar pill. Um, but I really want this. But I'm not going to order from the sugar pills website. And I really want their singles as well. I almost ordered them from Beautylish today. But I didn't. Never mind. Um, and I really wanted the stickers as well. But yeah. I'm going to have to wait to see if it comes to Beauty Bay. Or uh, 
uh, what's that site called? Love Makeup? I think so. But if it comes, I will buy it. But you know, sometimes the companies don't want to have the Swedish money, so <laughs> I don't know what to do about that. And can I put that in some... It's a rainbow palette, but I don't think... Oh, and I didn't drink. This is going to take forever. Then we have the Jeffree Star and Morphe palette. I have ordered this. I was not going to because I didn't think, oh my god, when I saw it. And it's not really a Jeffree Star palette, you know, Jeffree Star Cosmetics. But it was so affordable if you compare. And I was just being hyped and then I talked to Annette and I was like oh my god I have to buy it <laughs> so I bought it and it's it it's at the post office being held hostage so I, I will collect that tomorrow and if I remember correctly there's a pressed glitter in that one <laughs> pressed glitter in a palette we had two in a row I'm not that good so I can put an animation on the screen. I'm so sorry. That's why I have this physi physically. Yeah, sorry. Okay, what do we have next? Oh, the new Naked palette. I collect the Naked palettes. Uh, but I didn't buy the Reloader one. Um, I was not excited by uh, the color scheme, but I guess I can I can live with it. But the packaging, oh my god, I hate the packaging. I was in the store and felt it, and I was like, oh, I just hate the packaging. And now they are released, or they are going to release the Naked Honey. I like the packaging, but why? Why? It looks so boring. Honey? They, they only have brown palettes. I'm so disappointed. The only shade that looks kind of fun is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The seventh shade, what is it called? Sue. Oh, it's the shade called Honey. <laughs> it's the one that is shimmery, goldy green, whatever. That looks funny. But otherwise, I'm like, who asked for this? Who asked for this? I'm going to count that as a basic neutral palette. <laughs> I'm just saying. Poo poo! So disappointed. I hope I won't buy it. But you never know. <laughs> Ooh! Then we have Colourpop. <laughs> they released seven new singles but they have a whole rainbow collection and I really thought that I was going to buy the palette with you know all the shades because there are seven new ones and they are colorful so I want them and the other shades most of them are from palettes so they are not singles um, but they always put in sandbar I have three sandbars already enough uh, but and I thought I was going to buy that because it's a really nice price. I, if I was just going to buy the seven shades, it would be like $35. And then I can pay five more and get all of the shades, you know. And then I was also going to buy the Strawberry Shake palette. But I have just not done it. I don't know. I want to. But I shouldn't. And I'm crossing out Colourpop. Loop. And of course rainbow, but we have already crossed that out. Boop, boop, color pop. What else do we have? MAC. Oh yeah, I saw today a lipstick that is blue with stars. It's so pretty. I want it just for that. I want to use it. I don't even know what type of lipstick. 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 <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I'm entertaining myself. 
is it really not? No, it's just Pepsi Max. Lipstick. No, lipstick. It's so, so pretty. I want it, but I won't get it because we get MAC in Sweden, uh, but it's impossible to get new things. They are always out of stock on the website, if we even get them to the website. And on the stores, I, I live so I can go into Malmö, which is, you know, the th third largest city in Sweden. They are always sold out, if they even take in the things. So I'm never getting the MAC stuff. Um, but it's really pretty. But it's a holiday release. <laughs> holiday. Oh my god. So we have that. <laughs> what else do we have? I didn't put in Zodiac. Why? Why? Because we have... A new Zodiac palette from BH Cosmetics. That's so annoying because no, n no one, none, none of these palettes excite me. But I still want them. I, I'm, I'm, I'm weird. What is this? I can't talk about this because I don't know which brand it is. Oh, Glow Re Recipe. It's an avocado melt retinol, retinol sleeping mask and it's with an avocado. Is that expensive? It, I bet it's going to be expensive. And I'm just like, no, but that's fruit and veg, veg, vegetable. You know, that's called grön saker. I'm crossing that out. What do I have? I just have two in a row. This is going to take forever. What's this? Oh, Gerard Cosmetics and the Influencer collab with Rich Lux. I don't watch him. I just put lipstick here. Yes, don't do that. And they are releasing, it looks so fun. Busted the house ice cream shack and it's three setting sprays where one of them is a duplicate I don't get it. I have never tried the sleigh all day, but I I'm sorry. I might might be the only one. But I think that is so boring That is so boring. I will not buy that it's, the smell sounds great, but I've heard a lot of people say that that setting spray burns your eyes. You should close your eyes, but you know, we're all people here. So I'm going to cross that out. Yeah. What do we have next? KKW, is it called that? I, mm. it's uh, two neutral palettes, one cool tone and one warm tone. I will not link any information or anything down below, because, down below, because that's not the type of video. You can go to Angelica or someone. But I think these are very basic palettes and they don't look fun at all. Are they only matte? Yeah, 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 <laughs> they're only matte. I think the cool tone actually look kind of interesting, but I bet that I already have it and they're usually boring packaging and I'm not going to buy it, but I think the cool tone ones looks kind of okay. And this is my game now. So I'm going to count this as Kylie because they are the same, same shit but different, so. I'm going to cross that out. I'm just saying. Because they are the same. Okay. 
What else do we have? A two-faced holiday. Ooh. I'm looking at a picture with, I don't think it's just two-faced. No, they are from different brands. There are Smashbox. Yeah, you can see it, the picture, of course. But that uh, brush looks like a star, I think. Ooh. And that's the thing, you know. I didn't buy the Too Faced Holiday palette last year. I only bought the Gingerbread Spice palette. Um, because I have bought them the other two years, I think, for 17 and 16. And I've never used them and I've heard they are so bad quality. But this, I know everyone will hate this packaging. But I like when it's a different packaging. I think it's really cute and I'm going to take that as I want it only for the packaging actually because the colors are not that intriguing uh, I could be without that but I think it's fun oh I already have a lot of palettes that I have only for that but yeah it looks like that am I going to fill out this entire no I have three in a row oh I have four down here <laughs> and I am not I'm doing this. I'm so sorry, Teresa and Emily. I'm not doing this justice. Go watch them because they do this videos so much fun. I'm not fun. I'm just doing this for my own entertainment. And I should have been better prepared. I promise I will be that the next time. I promise. What else do we have? <gasps> a stick it's milk makeup new flex foundation stick and flex highlighter I was just going to take this up and show you but you, you will see it here but that's a stick and I'm not going to buy it but Paulina told me that um, where is the stick there uh, told me that milk makeup is coming here was it to Sephora? Yeah, it must be Sephora. Oh no. But yeah, uh, I want to try their blur stick, but um, I will not buy this. No. No. Let's see. What else do we have? Do, 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 do. Then we have another Too Faced palette called Palm Springs Dreams. I don't know if I like or hate the packaging. I like the packaging, you know, the packaging in itself. And it's pink, but I don't like the print. Does it mean anything special? I don't know. <gasps> it's a pop of blue! When I put these pictures together, I just took all the new things that I thought were either fun or something I wanted to talk about. And I thought I would never get bingo. But I have bingo. That means that the makeup companies are predictable. I have bingo! But yeah, I like this palette. And even if it's a pop of blue, it's not a neutral neutral there. The shimmers look really nice. And that orangey shade called Mocktail. But I don't know if it even comes to Sweden. I don't know if I would buy it, but I will not say no. But it's not like, oh my god, I must have it. So yeah, I have bingo. Woohoo! And that went very well and I have only filmed for 25 minutes but I promise the next time I will prepare a bit better and you know if I do this more I will get better at it but I think this was fun and uh, if you want to do this as well you are of course welcome to do so can you please tell me if you do that and um, if you want to 
you know, use this, you can just tell me. Uh, but otherwise, go to Teresa and Emily. Um, I think Emily has a link to her bingo sheet. I don't know what to call it. Um, and you can use hers if you want to, of course. Uh, but I have checked with them both, like I said, and they said it's okay. And I have bingo! Oh, was this boring? I don't know. But I just thought it was looked so much fun. But I promise I, I will prepare better next time. So don't be too harsh on me. And I hope I can manage to put in the pictures. And do you want me to talk more about the stuff or less? I don't know. Please tell me. But I think I will continue to do these types of videos either way. But it would be nice to know a bit what you think. Because I'm doing videos that I think are fun. But yeah. I, I'm very well aware that this is not my best work. <laughs> yes. But I think that was all for this video. Because now I have bingo. And that didn't take too long. But yeah. So... Uh, that was all for this and uh, I see you soon.